A, E, E, O, A, the short vowels. Lots of kids get them confused, especially kids with a history of speech sound disorder, language disorders, and children at risk of dyslexia. Compared to consonants, vowels are harder to hear and to distinguish from each other. Some students get confused between letter names and the speech sounds that are linked to them. Short vowel errors can drag down reading rate, accuracy, comprehension, and spelling. They can make things even harder when we step up to words with more than one syllable and words with longer vowel sounds. Vowel accuracy is a good predictor of longer term reading challenges. So here are five tips to help. One, use letter sound mnemonics. I like the reading doctor ones as well as the spellphabet ones, but you can make your own. Two, initially introduce vowels that sound and look different to each other. Three, listen to audio recordings of words containing the sound or sounds that you're targeting. Four, contrast vowel sounds in decodable sentences using minimal pairs, triples, or quads. Five, use short vowel signs. I like these ones. You want beginners to be confident with short vowel sounds before you step up to longer words and words containing the extended code.